Hey guys, what is up and welcome to another one of my Steven Universe Theory videos. This time we are going to be looking at Pearl. Pearl is my favorite character of the series, if not my favorite character of the series. And pretty much for a while now, there has been speculation even before uh, Back to the Barn that Pearl was a servant of some sort or a lower class gem. Uh, and that she belonged to somebody and then once we got you back to the barn is when we got confirmation that this theory was true That Pearl was a servant and belonged to someone, but we still do not know who she belonged to Now there are three possible theories for Pearl and who she belonged to one Theory and probably the most boring and also least possible theory at this moment is that she did not belong to a diamond at all she just belonged to some higher ranking gem in the gem homeworld society, but that'd be boring and bland and blah, and so I'm gonna say that that's probably the least likely out of the three. The other two theories is that Pearl either belonged to a white diamond or pink diamond. Now these are the two diamonds that we have not seen yet. We've only seen their murals of them. So that makes this theory even more complicated as to who she belonged to because we have not seen either of these characters within the series itself besides their murals. So the case for White Diamond. So for White Diamond, Pearl has a skin tone complexion that matches more of a white rather than a pink or any of the other colors of the diamonds or the pearls. So there's that, and there is also the gem placement. As we see in White Diamond's mural, we can see that there is a gem placement on her head. And then if you look at Yellow and Blue Diamond, they both have theirs on their chest, and also their pearls have those on their chest. So it seems that like diamonds and their pearls, gem placements match each other. So there's that, but I mean, there really isn't much more to go off of with white diamond which kind of leads into pink diamond as to why pearl would belong to pink diamond now pearl has kind of like a peachish hair but she doesn't have a pink skin tone complexion at all so we can really only go off the hair at this point because she does not have a gem placement on her navel where white diamond or um, excuse me pink diamonds is but something interesting to note is that in Space Race, Pearl did have a pink diamond on her spacesuit. So it can be assumed that the last diamond, if there, if Pearl belonged to, say, White Diamond before, you know, the diamond she currently had or last had before she decided to fight in the Rebellion, is Pink Diamond. So it's possible that Pearl could have belonged to White Diamond and then from White Diamond, Pearl got transferred over to Pink Diamond. Now, another possibility with this is if we look back at the return where Jasper says that Pearl is lost and defective, it could be because of her gem. Because even though Pearl has a gem in her forehead like White Diamond, it's not a perfect circle as we see with yellow and blue pearls. Hers is an oval. So it could be that Pearl was deemed defective for White Diamond and then once Pink Diamond began colonizing, earth white diamond transferred her pearl over to pink diamond and thus pearl belonged to pink diamond or it could be that pearl was made for pink diamond but she was deemed defective due to where her gem placement was and her gem shape there's still a lot we don't know and there's still a lot more clues that we need in order to come up to a pretty precise theory but that's pretty much all we have at this point to go off of. And if anything, the biggest piece of evidence that we have of Pearl belonging to someone is the pink diamond on her spacesuit, meaning that the last diamond that Pearl was with was pink diamond. So that's about all I have for now. Uh, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more Steven Universe related content. And until next time, guys, take care.